All right, let's get started. Today, we're flying a very cool helicopter into the city. Our task is to get to the city and there to buy a lot of cookies and have a rest. But the weather for flying really leaves a lot to be desired, so we need to be very careful. As you can see, friends, Mikey is sleeping right now. He is really tired of flying in the helicopter, so I'm making sure that we have a normal flight without too many problems. That's the most important thing right now. I think that's exactly what I'll do. A little rest and sleep so we can get to the city with strength. JJ, wake up as soon as you can. Something weird is going on in the helicopter. What? What could be going on here? I mean, it's pretty safe in here. There's no problem. Anyway, we'll be flying towards the city soon enough, and then we can have some fun and rest. That's the most important thing right now. JJ, look, there's some passenger eating bad meat. Where did he get it from? It looks really bad. Oh no, it's probably a zombie. We've got a real zombie in the helicopter that's gonna try to bite all the passengers. JJ, it's really starting. He started attacking others and making zombies out of them. We just have to do something. We have to destroy them as soon as possible before it's too late. Mikey, we have absolutely no weapons. We have to get out of here as fast as we can. Hide! The zombies are getting bigger and bigger. We can't hide. It's unrealistically hard. Oh no, we're locked in with them. What do we do? We have to somehow get out of here as fast as we can. It's only a matter of time before they attack us. We have to come up with some tactics. We have to distract them somehow and go to the cockpit. It's definitely safe there. No, Mikey. We 100% need to go backwards. It'll be much more effective. Let's go together. Anyway, we should make things quick and run through them. Then we can save ourselves. I think this is the best time to do it. Let's run as fast as we can, Mikey, to the very end. Oh no, I didn't make it, JJ. Those zombies are about to attack me and bite me. Get over here as fast as you can. This is your only chance to save yourself. You won't last out there. We have to get this resolved as quickly as possible so you can come back. This is really the most important thing. Anyway, the longer you do all this, the better off you'll be. Ouch, these zombies are hitting me and biting me. JJ, save me as fast as you can. I can't do this. Fight them off and get in as fast as you can to my place. It's safe and no one will hurt us. We have to survive in this helicopter and keep surviving inside. It's going to be really, really hard. You who, Mikey. You did it. You managed to escape and get to me. That's just great. Oh, I feel so bad. They hurt me really bad and I'm literally losing consciousness. You really need to get some sleep because you're in a really bad situation. As long as we're behind this iron door, these zombies won't be able to get in. I'll be in control. Friends, Mikey and I are trapped right now, but we will definitely survive inside the airplane. We just need some time to recover and try to destroy these zombies. Anyway, we'll get it done quickly. I hope we can solve everything quickly and without too much trouble. This is really very important. There are a lot of zombies out there who want to destroy us, but we won't give up so easily to them. I want to sleep. Oh, how much sleep have we had? Mikey, you got all those wounds on you from what they did to you. Does that mean I'm going to turn into a zombie? Hey, I don't want that. I don't want that at all. No, you don't. If you got bitten and didn't turn, that means you're immune to it. That's really good. We just need to heal all your wounds. Bandage them up. That sounds great. That means we might not be so afraid of zombies. We can definitely deal with it. Exactly. It's just a little bonus, but we can definitely do it all. My challenge is to find things I can help you with. Food and TNT are definitely not going to help us here. JJ, come on as fast as you can. I'm really hurting and I don't want to feel much. I know exactly what you mean, but you also have to realize that it's not a quick fix. We have a lot of issues to work out before we can continue with this. This is really very important to me. I want to get this over with as quickly as possible and continue thinking that you and I are going to be okay. Now turn around and let me heal all your wounds that you have on you. It's going to be really very easy. Thank you, JJ. You're really helping me. I appreciate it very much, my friend. But what's our next plan? We'll have to find weapons, armor, destroy the zombies, and go land this helicopter. We're going to survive inside that helicopter until it's safe for us and the city. I really hope we are safe in the city and we can make it there. Our task now is to finish everything as quickly as possible and get out to this zombie. We must destroy them. I hope there is a weapon here that we can really defeat these zombies with. I think we can do this task. It's nothing hard to do, Mikey. We just need to prepare well. 
Our job is to take this helicopter for ourselves and try to really defeat all the enemies in one fell swoop. We have to take this helicopter and bring it to the city. It will definitely be safe there, my friend. That's a great plan. I'm in. We can fly all the way to the end in the city. We can survive there. I'm sure there just won't be very many zombies there. I just hope so. We just have to take it and solve all the problems once and for all. Don't dwell on it, please. If there are zombies in town, it's really going to turn into a real zombie apocalypse very quickly. It's going to be just awful. I don't want all that. I want to just rest inside the city. If that's really true, we'll just have to find a safe place or make one. We can't just wipe out all the zombies. It's really incredibly difficult. I hope that each of us will draw our own conclusions and try to solve this situation. We have to be ready for anything. Our task is to really win and survive in this helicopter. Maybe if we don't make too much noise, these zombies will let us through and we can escape. Our task is to defeat them all. That's the only thing we have to do in the helicopter. We can't transport the infected. It's incredibly dangerous for everyone. Our biggest problem is that we are really trapped. We need to land the helicopter somewhere in the city. That's going to be a big problem because we can't really fly. It might take a while. I hope we won't have any special problems because I've flown in a helicopter once and I know how to do it. Great, there's guns in the cockpit and of course ammunition for all that. That means we can really save the helicopter since the pilot decided to jump. Shoot them all. We need to take them all out without too much trouble. Keep going. Yahoo, we did it. We were able to destroy all the zombies and secure this helicopter. Now we can finally take control and of course start flying towards the city. I want to get to safety as soon as possible. If that's possible, let's go as fast as possible. We have set the coordinates and now we can fly. We've gotten a little off track because the last pilot was afraid to fly with the zombies. But now that we've destroyed them all, we can go on. I really hope the city will be nice and quiet because I don't want to live inside a zombie apocalypse, JJ. We're going to fly now and see what's happening to the city. We're about to find out all about it. JJ, look at this. It's just unbelievably awful. The city is completely destroyed. Oh no, it's a really big problem. I never thought it would start so soon. The city is completely destroyed and all that's left are zombies. That's a big problem. What should we do? It's not like we can survive inside the city for so long, but we'll run out of fuel soon and we can't just fly somewhere. Do you have a plan? Of course I have a plan. We'll fly up to the tallest building and land there, of course. We'll wait it out. I hope we can get and find something useful for us. That would be just unforgettable. JJ, I don't like this plan. It could really be very dangerous because zombies will surround us all the time. We won't be able to fight them forever. How about something else? We'll make a safe base for ourselves here and survive as long as we can. There are a lot of supplies left in the city, so there won't be any big problem. We'll just be able to keep updating ourselves. Good, since you really want to do all this, let's do it. Fly as high as you can. This building looks good enough. It's not destroyed, so we can continue to survive here. You can see zombies in the windows inside, but that can be fixed. It's only a matter of time, to be honest. Look, it's the perfect place to land a helicopter. We'll have to clear this tower. Yes, that's exactly what I wanted to do. It's going to be unbelievably cool. Another challenge for us. Landed without a hitch. That's really good, because we couldn't even fly before. It really shows that we are ready for anything and everything. It's really cool. The whole problem is that the longer we do all this, the worse we're going to get. We have to solve everything very quickly. We'll have to go downstairs, destroy all the zombies, and of course take control of the building. It's a really difficult mission because there can be so many zombies in an office building. We have to be ready. Great. Now that we're ready, we just have to go out. It'll be all quiet on the roof. Mikey, our job is to destroy all the zombies, build a base, keep surviving here. We're gonna build a base inside the helicopter. It's really the smartest thing we've ever done. I totally agree with that. We just have to make the most secure base right here. That's why we'll go into the building and destroy all the zombies. We can win 100%. I hope we really solve all the problems very quickly. And I think we are one step away from success. We just need to use our weapons and destroy all the enemies that will be inside. I'm sure we are much stronger than all the zombies inside, but there could be a lot of them. That's why we'd better get ready and make everything pretty and stylish. I too hope we can organize it all and win. After all, it's quite a challenge. We can definitely do it all. You just need a lot more time, JJ. We can't beat all the zombies quickly. I'm ready for a long battle. I've been waiting all this time to really prove myself in battle. 
I hope we have enough weapons and everything to destroy all the zombies inside. It's going to be a big challenge. Zombies are the weakest monsters there can be. We will defeat them all quickly. You need to realize that even the weakest monsters in the group can be strong. So don't relax early and do your best to defeat these monsters. I hope we can do it. JJ, are we really the only survivors on Earth? Or is there someone else out there and they're defending themselves too? It's hard to say, Mikey. Maybe it's not as bad as we think. Maybe someone else is still fighting. Maybe we really are the only ones left on this Earth. We should definitely be careful. The whole problem is that we can't solve this problem very quickly. We'll have to learn a lot of new things all the time. Because if we're going to survive, we need all the skills we can get. I really hope this is really enough and we can move on. That's the hardest part. Every time I think about it, it gets harder and harder for me. I feel like we shouldn't stress too much about all of this. It should go its own way. We have to destroy monsters, gain something and lose something. That way we will quickly come to the point where we can realize all our ideas. I'm sure the sooner we do this, the better it will be. I just want to win once and that's it. It's really important. There might be some really useful things here in the office that I'd like to really use. It could all help us really build our rooftop base. That would really be incredible. Totally agree with you. We're really capable of building a cool base with everything here. That's the most important thing right now. The sooner we get all the resources, the sooner we can start building the base. Because these zombies are literally everywhere. They want to destroy us, and of course they want to win. But we won't let them. That's right. We are much stronger than all of them. I hope we can solve all these problems. Anyway, the sooner we get it all done, the better it will be. I just want to get justice. I want to organize the really best defense possible. To do that, I will do the most of myself. Anyway, we have a really difficult situation. There are zombies around. Chaos. Everything is destroyed. We have to build our own safe zone in this world, which will be our home. It's really hard to do, but we will definitely try. It just takes time to do it all. If we can really spend a lot of time on this, then we can definitely survive. I really hope our friends feel strongly for us and would definitely want us to survive. I'm sure they are supporting us. I'm sure they are worried and they just want us to be saved. If that's the case, then thank you very much, friends. We'll definitely get out of here and make our base. Actually, you and I are very experienced and strong. The sooner we would solve all this, the better. We just need a place to grow food. We need a safe place to sleep and stuff like that. We can use the roof and make everything earth and vegetables and put a bed inside the airplane. Oh, that's a really cool plan. I hope it really works and we can win. The only question that remains is, what do we do next? Are we going to look for survivors or will it be just the two of us? If it's just the two of us, it will be much harder for us to win. I'd say it's almost unrealistic. So I'd like to find the villagers and join forces. We could solve all the problems at once. Our base would be unbelievably cool. We'd be able to do anything we wanted to do. I hope we can find villagers and bring them to our village because they are important. So we've gathered all the blocks we need and now we're going to make our safe base. We're going to build traps and defenses so that no one can get inside our base. That's really the right thing to do. We have to solve all this as soon as possible. All I want to do is make sure we take matters into our own hands quickly and get on with things. I will in turn build us a farm, a huge farm. It's just going to be necessary for us. I really hope we can really organize and get it all done. It's necessary for us at the moment. Each of us is really working hard to get it all done and see it through. We want to create a base where there won't be much trouble and no one can destroy us. Zombies won't be able to get on the roof and it will be just the perfect place to keep the blow from them. I assure you. Well said, JJ. That's why you had our base defense on you. Next, try doing something else. I'll be building us an interior inside the airplane next. That's a lot of problems and solutions too. We should really make it so that we can move around the base in peace. That's going to be incredibly cool. Anyway, the faster we get all this done, the more efficiency we can show. I want to see this through to the end and be done with it all. It's really incredibly cool for us. I feel like everyone is trying to do something the best they can. I'm going to build an incredibly cool house. Our main goal is to make a strong defense around the whole tower on all of its floors. We're going to go down, destroy the zombies and take over the floors. It's going to be a big challenge. This could take a very long time. So we need to prepare ourselves that we are going to be leading all of this for a very long time. I hope that each of us will really try our best to end it all very quickly. We'll be able to take over some floors and make them into defenses or important facilities. I hope that we can do all this really fast so that we forget. If we can find some more fuel, we can fly this helicopter somewhere safe. 
I'm sure there are definitely more military bases and stuff. That's pretty cool. There's going to be a lot of weapons. There's gonna be a lot of protection and food and stuff. There'll even be machinery. It'll be incredible if we get inside a military base. That's where I'd like to live because it's the safest place in the world. The problem is that it's not going to be anytime soon. So we have to be patient. We have to make it so that we feel comfortable and safe here. That's why it will be survival, the real thing. It's time to do the interior inside the helicopter. I'm going to put furniture in here, all the essentials to make my room really cool. I really want my new home here because it's gonna be really cool. No one's ever done this before. It's really unique to have a house inside a helicopter. I'd say it's just unforgettable. Anyway, the sooner we all do it, the better it will be. I hope we can get it all done in time. All of it. We finally got to do what we wanted to do. It's our new base on the roof and inside the helicopter. Mikey and I did a good job, and now we want to get some rest. Watch some cartoons and eat some cookies. So friends, we are saying goodbye to you. We'll see you very soon. Bye everybody.